One of the counties under a flood warning tonight is Nassau County. This comes after the area saw flooding over the past few days due to heavy rain. News for Jack's reporter, anchor, and meteorologist Janice Harris live in Fernandina Beach where officials are asking for anyone with flooding to make them aware of it. Janice? Yeah, they're asking that because they're hoping to find a way to bring some resolve to any areas they're unaware of where there's been flooding. So we're in this park off Dolphin Road. This is in Fernandina Beach. To the right, you can see it's an empty park, beautiful green grass. But as we pan to the left, you can see there's a bowl portion where there's actually a bench where you can sit. Plenty of birds out here, but there's also water just, just kind of sitting inside of the space of this park. There is a drain in the center of it. We're trying to get more answers as to exactly what is happening here. The reason I say that is because the city of Fernandina Beach posted these images. And the images also show this exact same park bench underwater and a parking lot as well. So the city said in this post on Facebook that city staff, specifically the Stormwater Department, is working through the recent influx of drainage issues and concerns. They go on to say our community is going through a period of extraordinary rainfall. According to the St. John's River Water Management District for Nassau County, July rain was 142% of the monthly average and August was 204% of the average for that month. They say that is 7.11 inches more than average in one month. So I talked with the city of Fernandina Beach and I've been waiting for them to call me back. I talked to them on the phone. They said there's some clarification needs to be made, even about the photos and the images you're currently seeing live. However, today, it's been a little breezy today. Winds coming from the east. Also, the rain's been off and on. It's been cloudy and dreary nonetheless. But this is the time for folks to please be mindful as more rain will come through in the evening. Just pay attention if you see areas where there's water on the roads if you can't see the ground try not to drive through it turn around and find a different route because flooding is still possible going into the evening reporting live in nassau county janice harris channel 4 the local station